Good morning. Well, I must be a magnet for uh, old iron because look what followed me home. I think it was hooked up to a little three horse or one third horse electric motor which we're not sure if it came out of a washing machine but this is as cute as can be isn't it makes a little bit of noise this uh, wood frame they put it on acts a little like a drum but This is what I really want to show you right here. This one followed me home too. And uh, that was a WF and J Barnes. And this is the uh, Big Daddy. I don't know if you can see it. It's a number 13. And this one is, uh, looks like uh, 1880 patent date. I decided I like this one. It's, it's very complete. I got uh, all the tooling, some uh, very nice uh, chucks so I've just about decided to uh, to change it out this is the chuck that came with it which looks like an eight or nine inch chuck so I think it's coming out this uh, lathe here WP Davis I think I'm gonna remove it from the trailer and replace it with that WF Jay Barnes. This little one that I started with it, that's a, a number four and a half WF and Jay Barnes, which is uh, very similar to the, uh, the little velocipede I have here. The only difference that I can find is that this one, I looked at it, and right here, there's a patent date on the, uh, the one I just, just uh, drug home. So, probably what I'll do is, is uh, take this body right here, this, see this one is, uh, I think it's 1887, because it has a patent date on it, I would assume this one is earlier than, uh, than my velocity, which in my case, what I think I'll do is change this uh, lathe out with the with the legs and uh, and the pedals and everything with the other lathe to to put them together, make it earlier. The the other uh, little four and a half that I got. Uh, the pedals and uh, the pulley and uh, the seat, all of that I uh, found uh, extra. It didn't come with the with the lathe, so the, all this stuff really isn't together. Anyway, this is the. 
the uh, three-step pulley that I found to go with it. And uh, this is a, actually a replica seat made by the Amish out of Pennsylvania. They cast parts for early equipment and uh, steam-related items. But I uh, just thought I would uh, share this with you. I'm very excited. This this particular lathe here, the number 13, WFJ Barnes, is also early. I found one way to tell them that they're early. There's no guarding on any of the gears. They're just open. So. Uh, you got to watch what you're doing on these. There's no OSHA. And I guess uh, prior to 1900, you didn't watch what you're doing. They just eliminated you from the gene pool. After, after uh, 1900, I found they started putting guards on the gears and, and uh, covering them up. Well, thanks for watching. If you. Uh, have any comments, leave them below. Hit the like if you like it. Bye.